Welcome, my after horror ghosts. Today, we'll delve into the visceral dread that seeps through the very fabric of the anthology horror film VHS, exploring the true horrors of being seen dying and the unimaginable ways one can meet their demise. We're about to journey into the heart of darkness. If you enjoy our deep dive, remember to hit the like button, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. Now let's plunge into the depths of the abyss. In VHS, we're drawn into a terrifying world where death isn't just a fate endured in private. It's caught on tape, recorded and replayed, transforming the act of dying into a spectacle. What makes this so horrifying? Psychologists posit that the fear of dying before an audience heightens our existential dread. We crave dignity in death, yet being filmed robs us of this autonomy. The characters in VHS suffer this indignity, their final moments immortalized as a grisly spectacle. Let's examine the segment, Amateur Night. Lily's transformation and the brutal demise of her pursuers are shot through a hidden camera glasses. The viewer becomes an unwilling participant, directly experiencing the deaths of the characters in a horrifically intimate way. The film intensifies our fears not just by how death is seen, but also by showcasing horrifying ways to die. Death is unpredictable and unapologetic in its brutality. In Second Honeymoon, Stephanie gruesomely murders her husband Sam, exploiting his vulnerability. This underscores a primal fear, dying at the hands of those we trust. Similarly, the sick thing that happened to Emily when she was younger uses the horror of the unfamiliar, Emily's lover's horrifying betrayal. These are deaths of the mind where reality crumbles, leaving only terror. But where VHS truly shines is the intersection between these themes being seen dying in unimaginably horrific ways. This combination drives the film's relentless tension and terror. October 31st, 98 perfectly illustrates this. Our protagonists, filmed through a handheld camera, fall prey to an unseen malevolent force. Their gruesome ends are not just seen but also experienced in real time, amplifying the horror. VHS takes our primal fears and ramps them up forcing us to confront the dual horrors of being seen dying and the unimaginable ways we can die. More than just a film, VHS becomes a mirror that reflects our deepest fears and insecurities about death. It's a chilling reminder of the inescapable fate that awaits us all, and the dread of facing that fate under the watchful gaze of others. As we sign off, we invite you to ponder on this. What makes death truly horrifying? Is it the act itself, the way it's seen, or the dreadful combination of both? Remember to share your thoughts in the comments section below. If you've enjoyed this deep dive into the terror-filled world of VHS, give this video a thumbs up and share it with fellow horror enthusiasts. Don't forget to subscribe for more in-depth film analysis. Until next time, stay safe and remember, it's just a movie, or is it?